Working in small groups and responding to ideas from others makes learning experiences collaborative. In this project, students take on the role of architects who collaborate with designers, engineers, educators, and students to design an innovative school that meets learners' needs. Instructions. Students will need access to paper and colored pencils, modeling clay, and recycled materials. This activity typically takes two class periods, one to design and the other to build the schools. The challenge, a new school. Design a new school that makes learning exciting. Step one, create. In the first class, students will work in small groups to develop initial ideas for their new school. Every individual should sketch their ideas so it is easy to see what each team member thinks. Making ideas visible helps communicate ideas. As a collaboration exercise, each team should develop their own strategy for how they will work together on the project, but you can give them a few prompts. Who do architects need to work with to understand what people need? What roles will members of the team need to take on? In the second period, the groups will work from their initial sketches to build prototypes using modeling clay and recycled materials. Step two, present. Once complete, each group will present their building and describe how it meets the brief to make learning exciting. They should also describe how they worked together as a team. How did they make sure they heard everyone's ideas? Decide which contributions to use. Collaboratively construct the prototype. And how would they assess their teamwork? What could they improve? Step three, respond. After the presentations, classmates respond by asking questions. Some questions might be about the building, specifically how each group determined what the user needs were. But students should also hold their classmates accountable for collaborative decision-making and planning. Was everyone on the team clear about the goal? Did everyone have a job to do? How were decisions made? Step four, connect. To connect this activity to other areas of the curriculum, you can adjust the brief or add constraints. For example, how does weather and geography impact building design? How might you make the whole school truly accessible for someone with a disability? Or how might a school's design encourage collaboration among students? Brought to you by Crayola Create Ed Professional Learning.